We're going to evaluate the limit of the natural log of x as x approaches 0 from the right. Of course, we can't plug 0 in because natural log of 0 is undefined. But if you understand how the function works, or you've seen the graph, we can see that the limit should be negative infinity. Of course, 0 is approaching from the right because natural log is undefined for any number that's not positive. So we need to approach 0 from the right. To figure out what this limit is, we're going to use a previous result, that the limit of the natural log of x as x approaches infinity is infinity. And I'll leave a link in the description to the lesson where we prove this result. For today's limit, we're going to want to change the variable in a way that will allow us to use this previous result. So what we'll say is let y equal 1 over x. And this is going to help us out. What we need to notice is that as x approaches 0 from the right, which is what's happening in our limit, What's going to happen to y? Well, that will become 1 divided by some really small positive number. So that's going to be some giant positive number. So as x approaches 0 from the right, y will be approaching positive infinity. Now we can start to rewrite this limit. Putting the original limit now in terms of y, it's the limit of what's natural log of x. Well, y is 1 over x, so natural log of x, if we want to write it in terms of y, would be natural log of y to the power of negative 1, because if we invert y, we would just get x. And then, of course, instead of x approaching 0 from the right, we'll write that y is approaching infinity, since as x approaches 0 from the right, y is approaching infinity. Now we can use our log rules. So this is going to become the limit as y approaches infinity. And then we have a power of negative 1 inside the log. So we can bring that down as a factor. So this becomes negative log of y. And we can just slide that negative all the way out. So what we have is negative limit of natural log of y as y approaches infinity. And now we can use our previous result. We know that natural log of x with x approaching infinity goes to infinity. So similarly, natural log of y as y goes to infinity is infinity. But then we have a negative out front. And so our final answer is negative infinity. So that's it. To evaluate the limit of natural log of x with x approaching 0 from the right, we use a change of variable using y equals 1 over x, and then we just apply a previous result. The limit turns out to be negative infinity. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or video requests. Stratus